Oh, hi there. It's me. I uh, have some music equipment for sale. Okay, old violin. You know, it's got this at the back of it. Make an offer. Uh, Mackie 1402 VLZ Pro mixer. Okay. I've got all these cables, which are patch cables and adapter cables for it. Uh, in addition to uh, MIDI cables, the MIDI cables might go separately, okay? Okay, as I said, the 1402 uh, VLZ with audio cables. And is some adapter cables. RCA adapter cables. I've got some of these uh, USB to device adapter cables. Okay. A uh, CAD 25A microphone and a uh, microphone cable. That's valuable as well. The microphone's in there. Okay. The Korg MS2000R. There's some knobs that aren't around. You can just make your own knobs, reorder them online, or turn them by hand. Turn them by hand if you're using it right away. Okay. There's no uh, adapter cable. Unit may need to be tested. Okay. It should be fine. Okay. The US122 audio MIDI interface. That works with the older versions of Windows. Uh, you can get Linux for it, drivers for it. I don't know if it works for the new ones. It's a recording card. Okay. The X session uh, MIDI control uh, box. I am audio. That's a very useful for software synthesizers. Okay. The Novation A station. Okay. This is a nice one. I noticed that, to be honest with you, there's something inside rattling. Sounds like a screw or something. Again, I have no adapter. It was working. I used to use it. And uh, so that needs to be checked out. No adapter. If you have a uh, universal adapter, a multi-prong adapter, it will work for both of these. Okay, so you can test them out. Okay, I've got a uh, Super Bass 4.4 TB303 clone by Next. The adapter was also disappeared. You need a AC 12 volt adapter, not a DC, an AC 12 volt adapter, okay? This is a special unit. I wanted to keep this one, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to, because I just won't use it. It'll sit there, so this one is a, have a look at that one, if you're interested. Uh, Yamaha TX81Z FM synthesizer. They might have programs for it online. It's still got the card here with the algorithms in the bottom. I'll pull it out, it shows you how to program it. Oh, one second. That's a good one if you have time to play with it. And an effects unit after it is recommended, like reverb or delay. But, you know, play with it. Um, SP505 
groove station, sampler, drum machine uh, with effects. It's nice. Uh, you know, might be if you got a computer, it might be boring. You might get really good at it. I don't know. I didn't play with it too much. Okay, this is what how I was driving the synthesizers mostly when it wasn't a computer. The M Audio Key Station 49E USB keyboard. So a couple of these uh, that hook uh, this to your computer. Okay. It's got a stand on it. This can hook into your computer and feed the MIDI out of your computer to uh, the, these units. Okay, that's how you play on, on them through a computer. Okay, uh, a Korg Electribe again, no adapter. See the notes for that. Those you need the same type of universal adapter. I don't have it anymore. I cut it up. I had to use it for something. Uh, EA1. This is a nice unit, kind of like that. Okay, but it doesn't sound as good, in my opinion, as the uh, that other clone that you need a special AC adapter for. It might be expensive. Okay, and yeah, that's about it. So again, that's what I have. The uh, cables will probably go with the mixer, or make me an offer on it. So the EA1, the uh, keyboard M Audio Key Station 49E, the SP505. Uh, the Yamaha TX81Z, the Super Bass 4.4, uh, the Novation, I believe that's the A Station, yes, that's right, the A Station, uh, the Korg MS2000R, the M Audio X Session, uh, the uh, Tascam US122, uh, the Mackie 1402VLZ Pro, uh, the CA CAD 25A microphone and microphone cable and then the old violin okay um, if you want to make an offer on all of it uh, go, go for it that will get preference okay uh, take care